but very close. Now up on the Matrix board, they have a happy birthday to our buddy, Ernie. He took it off, so. Waddell Washington leads off. He homered off Soto and then was really knocked down by Soto. And Claudel very unhappy about that. And the bat flew out of his hands. Let's and watch now Soto it. Let's waves watch. To Claudel. Let's watch here. Soto and and Claudel. There they go. Bill Ardello. Bill Ardello tackled Claudel. And now both teams are out there. Both teams are out on the field fighting. It was Bill Ardello who came from behind to tackle Claudel. Soto, I don't know if you saw that, Soto kind of waved him on with his hand, and that's all Claudel needed. The bat did not go near Soto. The bat was going towards second base, but I wouldn't be surprised if Claudel is thrown out of the game. We'll see. And now order has been restored. That's Rick Camp, Bob Watson, Jerry Royster holding Claudel. Tony Perez is there just trying to cool down Claudel. Claudel being held by Watson, Tony Perez, and Jerry Royster and Ramirez now. I'll tell you what almost happened there. Right when Claudel made his first move toward Mario Soto, Soto still had the ball in his hand. He tried to hit Claudel with the baseball, and I think he got plate umpire Lanny Harris a little bit. Might have got him on the left hand, and he threw that ball very hard. It's a wonder that nobody got seriously hurt in there. Claudel is angry, so is Mario. But really, it's Claudel who's the angriest right now. Claudel. Homered his first time, then he was flipped by Soto last time up. Washington later struck out and had some looks for Soto, and we followed him in the dugout. He threw his helmet down. He was angry. Joe Torre trying to tell Claudel two things. One, please calm down. We want you in the game. And two, we also don't want you getting hurt. Claudel has been the most valuable brave. He gets a hand as he leaves from the near sellout crowd. All right, here's a replay. Okay, this is something I'm sure Claudel had been thinking about for two innings. He knew exactly what he was going to do. Saw him take a look at his hands there, but he's not going after the bat. The bat's more over toward first base, as you can see Perez picking it up. Claudel wasn't walking toward first base. He was walking toward the mound, thinking about it, looking, talking, and now going after Mario. Now watch Soto throw the baseball here. Right there. That's where he tried to hit Claudel on the ground. He might have hit Joe Pignatano, the first base coach who was coming over for the Atlanta Braves. Here's another look. Here's another look. He's trying to hit Claudel. He did not hit Claudel, but he might have hit Joe Pignatano, or he might have hit, well, there's why plate umpire Lanny Harris. He was on the bottom of that heap. That's why he got shaken up. First of all, he threw a punch with that baseball in his hand, and then he threw the ball. Now, just because we're with the Braves, we're not holding up for Claudel over Mario Soto but you know if you're going to fight you have to fight you don't throw a baseball that's Joe Pignatano leaving I think he got Pignatano because but if he got him he got him on the leg Joe's a pretty tough guy in fact he's a very tough guy well now we have to find out what the umpire is going to do I think they're both out of the game I think Claudel's out and I think Soto's out too you can't, you can't throw a baseball at a guy from five feet and stay in the ball game right. and you can't charge a pitcher and right. try to fight him and stay in the ball game both well, the Reds are going to get a left hander in there's Soto the wild doings before a near capacity crowded it at Atlanta Fulton County Stadium Claudel you know Pete you were right he had been thinking about it and that was his course of action sometimes batters will bunt down the first baseline that's Bill Shearer We've got some highlights for you. And this is uh, Claudel's home run leading off the bottom of the first. It was number nine. And he's hit so many off Soto this year. I believe it's four. It'll play a part in the rest of the game. We'll see that as we move along. He's decked here. Washington knocked down by Soto. 
and he's thinking about coming up. Now this is in the fifth inning. He lets the bat go or it slips out of his hand. One or the other. And we're going to have a break issue.